Hey, 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 y'all. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am your favorite girl, A. Marie, and today's video is going to be the shameful perfume haul. If you guys are interested in seeing the perfume item picked up so far, then just keep watching but before we go any further i would love for you guys to hit the subscribe button as well as turn on your post notification set your post notification to all and comment down below what's your favorite perfume at the moment now let's get into it all right y'all so i'm addicted to smell goods ever since i joined this facebook group called sis you smell good Uh, I don't y'all I'm addicted thanks to Peyton Charles Platinum Bean Gina Janine and Leah Janae thank y'all for giving me a new addiction now for years my best friend has worked at a Bath and Body Works and I've always been a Bath and Body Works queen you hear me I never had like the biggest collections of Bath and Body Works, but I've always stayed with Bath and Body Works for many, many, many years. Okay. But this, if y'all haven't seen my previous monthly perfume buys, I will have it linked wherever the card is. Go watch it. A little, a little, little retail therapy at the Victoria Secrets. I went to go get my Mac fixed. Come to find out I couldn't get it fixed because the part that needed to be fixed, Apple no longer carries. So basically my Mac is just, I'm just, I'm just ass at this point. Um, yeah, I have to buy a whole new Mac. So I got angry, went across the hall, so Victoria's Secrets was having a sale. Um, I think the sale was five for 40. Yeah, five for 40. I think all of these are gonna be 11.95. Okay, so I picked up Victoria's Secrets Amber Romance Fragrance Mist, Deep Amber Sugar Kisses, Chasing Sunsets, romance romantic sexy is what this smells like i have a very small very very small victoria's secrets collection that someone bought me years ago i still have it and i love it so i was happy to buy this i bought the matching lotion to go with it so i also got bare vanilla cashmere mist and this one is plus patchouli vanilla orchid all wrapped up in bare vanilla it smells so good it just puts a smile on my face and i also got the bare vanilla lotion it didn't have the bare vanilla cashmere so i just got the bare vanilla so that i could pair it with the bare vanilla cashmere and then the last item I got was the Love Spell Cashmere. This is rich nectarine, fluffy marshmallow, all wrapped up in Love Spell. Ugh. And I have Love Spell Spray. I have the actual perfume, not body mist. I probably have the body mist too. But this is my Victoria's Secret purchase. That was like retail therapy. What do they call it? When you go buy things because you're angry. What is that called? Y'all tell me down below. Moving on to my Target buy. Okay, so Leah Janae and Platinum D slipped up and told me they called me. Not really. And was like, girl, finally. Is dropping seven, seven new cents. What you gonna do? I said, I gotta go buy. Let me just show you what I got while I was on that good old 
Samsung. Okay. I got the Mix Bar Passion Fruit Nectar. This is the perfume, not the body spray. And the notes, a delectable blend of sweet passion fruits, sugar, magnolia, and rich nectar inspired by a twist on a classic Bellini cocktail. I needed to get it. It was on my list to buy. So I got it. And this will be my first mix bar perfume. I do have a mix bar body spray maybe, or maybe the samples, but this is the first perfume. Yeah, this is like a cocktail drink, a fruity margarita. I'm excited. I picked that up. And basically, if I didn't already tell y'all, basically these are like, not necessarily a blind buy, but a non-smelt buy, if that makes sense. All right, so the next one I picked up was Good Chemistry. This one is the Coffee Cloud Body Mist. Now, I picked it up because it said Coffee Cloud, okay? I haven't heard anything bad about Good Chemistry, and I've heard very little about Good Chemistry, so... I just needed to pick it up. Bergamot, espresso, and cedarwood. Okay, so let me tell you, this smells like an Ariana Grande perfume, and I don't smell any coffee. It says espresso, but I'm not getting it. All right, and then I got two roll-on perfumes. So this is by Good Chemistry too, and this one is in the scent Queen Bee. It's a roll-on. Vibrant bow with a touch of sass. I got it because it's a queen bee and it made me think of Beyonce. Okay, so this one is black currant, peony, and amber. Y'all, I am an amber freak. Super cute. I like it. Let's spray it and see. Crazy part. I really don't get the amber feel. To me, it's almost like a good smelling soap, like a caress soap or something. Caress body wash. Powdery, maybe floral, but fruity. It smells real good, but I'm not picking up on the amber. Maybe the black currant is what's projecting more. I don't know, but so far I did good. The other travel size that I got and now we're moving on into our finery purchases. I got the finery Not Another Cherry. It's the dupe for Tom Ford Lost Cherry. I got it in the travel size because I had it in a sample and I don't like cherry but my wife said that she loved this scent. So I was like you know what let me get the travel size and if I could I was able to stomach the sample but it wasn't but this much in there so i got the travel size and i was like you know what if i could you know rock this without getting like sick of the cherry scent then i may buy the body mist i won't go all out and buy the perfume but i'll buy the body mist oh it looks sexy come on finery see yeah i'm getting the cherry scent but also something else. The, the notes are wild cherry, Turkish rose, almond, amaretto. So maybe it's the rose and amaretto. Oh, y'all hate them things. Did y'all see that? <laughs> Those big old dinosaur mosquitoes. But anyways, the Turkish rose and the almond is probably what I love about it. I smell the cherry, but the cherry is not too much to where it makes me nauseous. So I'm gonna try it. I picked up three body mists from Finery. Only one of them is the newest scent because for some reason online they said they have it, but they really didn't have the new scents. So I got one new body mist scent that dropped and then I got one perfume of the new dropped fragrance 
make sense? Am I making sense? Anyways, let's, okay. So I got sweet on the outside. Now, to my understanding, I think sweet on the outside is a Billie Eilish inspiration. The Billie Eilish. Now, if you don't know, I just purchased the Billie Eilish perfume. And hopefully, I will be able to pair it with that Billie Eilish. This is not a new scent. I think this is possibly an original scent. Then, I picked up the Jungle Santal. I don't know which one that one is is inspired by i want to say santal 33 santal jungle now they do have a scent at marshall's and tj maxx that is called santal something that smells just like this and if i'm not mistaken this inspiration is santal 33 i don't know but it gives me like a smoky woody sexy almost cologne type of smell but you could tell it's for women so moving on really quickly because i'm down to the last two let me get my downloads back up i don't have the inspiration of these last two so the newest one that dropped is the without a trace i got the body mist but if I'm not mistaken, I think Leah Janae said that this was inspiration of a Chanel perfume. And from what she said is that a lot of people that has smelled this brings them back to a particular thing. Some people get emotional when smelling this. Some people are reminded of something by this. But this smells damn good. And now that I think about it, this kind of do bring me back, puts me in the mind frame of my Aunt Denitra that passed last year. For some reason, this makes me feel like this was a scent that she wore. It's soft, powdery, floral, and seductive. Like, that's what I'm, that's, that's what I'm getting. But this is the newer one they dropped okay without a trace and lastly i had to get a part perfume because they were out of the body mist and these are a no smell buy okay i picked up the madame perfume now this says it smells like creme de cassis velvet oris and patchouli i love 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 the perfume bottle it is glass it's a beautiful pink and I love it so oh it feels like I smelled this before this is a daytime brunch lunch day party type of scent you run your errands type of scent that's the only explanation description I could give you guys but there you have it, you guys that is all the perfumes that I picked up lately now if i shall pick up any more perfumes you guys are gonna have to wait to the end of the month hopefully y'all enjoyed this video let me know what do you plan on picking up let me know what is your favorite scent right now in the moment and i will have all of these perfumes listed down below i do know that the victoria's secret sale is possibly not going on no more but i'm pretty sure they're having some type of sale and I would just link these down below anyway <laughs> so that y'all could go and buy it because y'all y'all heard what I had to say about it so now that's me telling y'all it's okay y'all could go buy it like comment subscribe click the notification let's talk about it down below I talk back and I will see y'all in the next one deuces <laughs>